Uh, so welcome back guys. My name is Amlan and in today's Make Watch Free campaign we go about looking at how you can fix that touch thing not working on your Android phone. Now I have a Samsung phone with me and it's quite possible that if you are having one of the Samsung phones at some point in your using of the phone you may have seen that the touch simply refuses to behave and since most of this Android phones are touch based so if the touch isn't working well it often renders the device useless. Now at such points it's important to know that a simple restart of the phone can save your day. So just go ahead and figure out how you can restart the phone. Now if you are having a Samsung phone pressing on the power button like this and like you want to touch the power off but because the touch isn't working I can't do that. So what I actually advise is holding on to the volume down and the power button and hold on to that state for some time. This may be from 10 to 15 seconds. So you will see the screen and then this will disappear and then the black screen comes and then the phone reboots. And once the phone reboots and the phone starts, you will then be able to use the phone. The touch should start working. Now this is all if it's not a serious hardware issue. If it still refuses to behave, just go to the store and get perhaps the screen changed. But I think you would not be needing that. Simply restarting the phone like this and your phone should be ready to go. So now here you will see I am now able to like put in my screen pattern and do everything. The touch now works. So go ahead and let me know whether this helps, whether you have a Samsung, whether you have like a Micro Max or something else and whether restarting the phone by simply keeping the power button pressed or maybe in case you have a Samsung maybe holding the volume down and the power button both together pressed and you know once the phone reboots, things starts working magically. So let us know if this helped. If it does, kindly subscribe to the channel. Your super thanks will also help me. Also, please do share this with your friends on social network as much as possible. I really think this can help people. If you have found an alternative solution, do put that as well in the comment section. People should actually come together and help find fixes for common smartphone issues. Until next time, it's me, Amnan, signing off. If you like, please do subscribe and click on the bell icon for notifications.